Those numbers state have already transitioned to virtual learning for the remainder of the week before everyone leaves for the holidays. For the England School District, it's a regular week, but plans have already been altered for after the break. THV 11's Mercedes McKay explains. When the school bell rings this Friday, students in the England School District will head back home for the long winter break. But when classes begin again on January 6, no students will be entering through the school doors. I think it's going to keep our staff and our, our students safer by doing this. The England School District is deciding to be proactive rather than reactive, making the announcement one week before school lets out for the holidays that the district will transition to virtual learning for seven school days after winter break. That way, if somebody is around family or they get sick, that they would start to see symptoms before we come back to school and they spread it. Superintendent Tyler Scott says the idea came from the high school nurse. They understand people will probably be around their families at Christmas and they hope this will help flatten the curve. The school district is asking parents to limit contact with people beginning January 2nd so everyone can return healthy on the 19th. I hate that I won't see my students face to face during that time, but I know that there's a good reason behind it. As both a parent and a teacher of the England School District, Tiffany Thompson is happy administration made the decision, not only for her kids and student safety, but also her own since she's considered high risk. I like not having to worry as much about my children getting sick or bringing something home with them to myself. Teachers like Thompson will have to return to school on the 6th to teach virtually, but will stay isolated inside their classrooms. District leaders ensuring all this is done with students' health and safety as its top priority. Just know that the district and myself, we have your children's best interest. Students will return to in-person learning on Tuesday, January 19th. In England, Mercedes McKay, THV 11 News.